Are electric vehicles losing their charge? The EV market is sparking debate as owners are revving up to switch back to gas-powered cars. What's driving this U-turn? EV owners are hitting roadblocks with charging troubles, lack of infrastructure, and range anxiety. These challenges are leaving them stranded and feeling the shock of a stalled revolution. Despite being touted as the future, EVs are struggling to outshine their gas-guzzling counterparts. The growing gap between EV supply and demand is casting a shadow over the entire market. While not all models are affected equally, many EVs are running out of juice when it comes to meeting expectations. We'll explore the surprising trends and developments shaping the EV landscape and the impact on disillusioned owners. Buckle up as we delve into why some drivers are unplugging from the electric dream and going back to the familiar rumble of gas-powered engines. Are EVs losing their charge? Or is this just a pit stop on the road to a greener future? The rise of electric vehicles in 2021 and 2022 seemed like the dawn of a new era. But a closer look reveals a different story. The surge in EV purchases was not a sign of a mass exodus from gas-powered cars. Instead, it was a trend among affluent households looking to stay trendy. For these owners, EVs were never meant to replace their traditional vehicles. They were simply an addition, a complementary vehicle in their garage. In these households, EVs often play the role of a second or even third vehicle primarily used for local trips. When it comes to longer journeys or more demanding drives, internal combustion engines still reign supreme. This behavior indicates that most EV owners weren't truly committed to switching to green energy. They were merely testing the waters of new technology. The numbers support this. Only 37% of Mustang Mach-E owners purchased another EV while nearly half opted for another internal combustion vehicle. This pattern is consistent across other car makers and models, with Tesla being the exception, thanks to its high percentage of loyal customers. The reality is that convenience and practicality still drive most car buying decisions, overshadowing environmental concerns. While the EV market has seen significant growth, it's clear that for many, electric cars are just a fleeting trend, not a long-term commitment to sustainable transportation. Are electric vehicles hitting a roadblock? A shocking 70% of drivers are ditching their EVs and switching back to gas-powered cars, and the reason is a real shocker. Charging nightmares. According to Clean Technica, the charging problems are a major roadblock for EV owners. Imagine this. You buy an EV, expecting a smooth ride into the future. But instead, you're stuck with slow overnight charges from a regular outlet or pricey fast chargers at public stations that are about as reliable as a broken GPS. In fact, in the San Francisco Bay Area, a region known for its EV-friendly infrastructure, one out of every five charging attempts failed in 2023. From faulty payment systems to broken cords, the list of charging woes is as long as a cross-country road trip. Drivers are waking up to the harsh reality that EVs aren't as reliable as they thought. Despite loving the performance and design of their EVs, they're finding that they just can't depend on them. It's not just about being unprepared for a surge in electrification. The current charging infrastructure can't even handle the EVs on the road today. As more drivers face these shocking truths, the electric dream is starting to fade. Are EVs really the green future we've been promised, or are they just another pit stop on the way to a more so sustainable tomorrow? Attention potential EV buyers. Beware of the range illusion. While advertised ranges may sound impressive on paper, real-world autonomy often falls short of expectations. Despite technological advancements, many EV models struggle to deliver on their promised range of over 300 miles. Why the discrepancy? Blame it on battery limitations and driving habits. Batteries are still grappling with heavy usage and extreme weather conditions, leading to premature depletion. And if you have a lead foot, expect your battery to drain faster than you can say electric revolution. But the biggest letdown? Electric pickups. Sure, they boast towing power comparable to gas guzzlers, but their range takes a nosedive under heavy loads. 
Motor Trend tested an all-electric F-150 Lightning with various trailers, and the results were shocking. The claimed 280-mile range dwindled to a mere 115, 190 miles depending on the trailer weight. It's clear, electric pickups have a long way to go before they can rival their conventional counterparts. And let's not forget reliability issues. From faulty charging systems to inconsistent performance, EV owners are facing a bumpy ride on the road to sustainability. So, before you jump on the electric bandwagon, consider the real-world limitations. Are EVs truly ready to revolutionize transportation, or are they still stuck in the slow lane of progress? Forget what you've heard about EVs being reliable. The truth is, they're not living up to the hype. Despite early promises of simplicity and reliability, EVs are proving to be quite the opposite. According to a recent Consumer Reports survey, covering over 300,000 vehicles from 2000 to 2023, electric cars are causing 80% more problems than their gas-powered counterparts. From charging and battery failures to non-functional tech features, EV owners are facing a host of issues. Poor build quality is also a common complaint, with owners citing misaligned exterior panels and faulty interior parts. Take, for example, the Chevy Blazer EV. This electric SUV was plagued with design flaws that even left journalists unable to complete their test drives. Battery and charging problems, coupled with software issues, turned the Blazer into a nightmare for owners. Within just two months and under 2,000 miles, more than 20 faults appeared on diagnostics, according to Edmonds. Sadly, the Blazer is not an isolated case. Most EVs end up at the bottom of reliability lists, with Tesla being the only exception. Tesla's models are the closest to average when compared to gas-powered cars. So, before you jump on the EV bandwagon, consider the reliability factor. Are EVs really worth the hassle and expense? It's a question more and more drivers are asking as they find themselves stranded by the side of the road, regretting their decision to go electric. The notion that electric vehicles are cheaper to run has been shattered, leaving many owners feeling misled and disappointed. While EVs were marketed as a cost-effective alternative to gas-powered cars, the reality is far from it. Charging an EV at home may seem economical, but once you venture into public charging territory, costs can soar higher than gasoline. Maintenance, often touted as a benefit of EV ownership due to the lack of fluid changes, presents its own set of challenges. The weight of EVs leads to faster tire wear, adding to the overall cost of ownership. Repairing an EV after a collision can be a costly affair. Most EVs are constructed with aluminum, and many parts are designed in a way that repair is impossible, necessitating costly replacements. This is especially true for the battery housing, which is not only vulnerable, but also requires specialized repair techniques. Speaking of repairs, finding trained professionals for EV repair is challenging, leading to higher service costs. Insurance for EVs is also notably higher than for gas-powered cars, adding to the financial burden. When you factor in these costs along with the initial purchase price, it's no wonder why many EV owners are having second thoughts about sticking with electric. The idea of owning another EV becomes less appealing when faced with the harsh reality of the financial implications. The sticker shock of electric vehicles is hitting hard, with many owners opting out of another EV purchase and turning back to gasoline or hybrid technology. And can you blame them? EVs come with a hefty price tag, still significantly pricier than their internal combustion counterparts. In the past year, the average EV purchase has hovered between $55,000 and $60,000, a figure that's out of reach for many buyers. According to Edmonds, potential EV buyers are searching for something more affordable, with 47% aiming for an EV under $40,000. Only a fraction, less than 30%, are willing to shell out $60,000 or more for an electric ride. The demand for affordable EVs is clear. A recent study by the Boston Consulting Group reveals that buyers want an EV that costs less than $50,000 can travel 300 miles on a single charge and can recharge in just 20 minutes. But currently, there's only one EV on the market that meets all three criteria. With immature technology and sky-high prices, it's no wonder many EV owners are breathing a sigh of relief 
as they return to the familiarity of gasoline-powered vehicles. When it comes to affordability and practicality, EVs still have a long way to go before they can compete with the tried-and-true internal combustion engine. For most EV owners, practicality, not sustainability, was the driving force behind their purchase. They were lured by the promise of convenience, practicality, low running costs, and seamless operation. However, the reality has fallen short of expectations. Current EV technology is a disappointment in many aspects. Whether it's the limited range, slow charging speeds, or overall performance, EVs have failed to deliver. The F-150 Lightning's range limitations are a prime example of these shortcomings. Adding to the frustration is the unreliability of public charging stations, further highlighting EVs' lack of convenience compared to gas-powered cars. Moreover, EVs come with a higher price tag, and the rapid pace of technological advancement leads to buyer's remorse. Despite these drawbacks, internal combustion cars continue to offer proven design solutions that many find more reliable and practical. As the electric vehicle revolution hits a few bumps in the road, it's clear that the journey to a greener future is not without its challenges. From range anxiety to charging woes, EV owners are facing a reality that falls short of their expectations. Despite the promise of convenience and lower running costs, EVs are struggling to live up to the hype. With high prices, unreliable charging infrastructure, and technological limitations, many are finding that the grass isn't always greener on the electric side. While EV technology continues to improve, it's evident that we're not quite ready to say goodbye to the reliability and practicality of internal combustion cars. As EV owners weigh their options, the allure of proven design solutions is hard to resist. So, as we navigate the twists and turns of the EV landscape, one thing is clear, the road to a sustainable future is still under construction. Will EVs eventually take the lead, or will internal combustion cars continue to reign supreme? Only time will tell, but for now, the electric dream may need a pit stop to recharge and regroup 